everybody welcome or welcome back tapers on a budget i'm april and today i'm going to be unstuffing my wallet and then doing a couple of savings challenges uh this is actually my second time recording this video i had to undo everything and i'm going to start it again because my daughter is in the background playing with lego and she was being very very loud and i finally was like okay that's it um so anyway i gave up got her all sorted and now i'm starting again and now mickey has decided that it's time for him to have some attention anyway uh what did we spend this week okay so abby still has her five dollars gas i still have ten dollars left which when i opened this the first time i was very surprised to still have gas left um but now i'm not because you know i saw that already um groceries still has 20 but it's being carried over this is not the week that we add to groceries it's the midweek between pay days and then my personal i have five dollars left so that's it i've already taken out my coin um and put it in here along with uh, the coin that tyson had i always zip this up and go to put it away i don't know why okay um, so I have money left and I don't normally have money left. I mean, sometimes a five, but that's very odd that I have money. But anyway, so what am I going to do? So Abby is going to get $5. Um, gas is getting 20 and I had a little debate with myself because I was thinking that I needed 40 um, but I only work one day this week because I did a switch. Um, oh no, I do work two days cause I work Thursday. Oh darn it. Oh no. So I do need another 20. Um, Tyson can't drive me on school nights cause we don't get home until well after Abby goes to bed. So I need to come up with $20 from somewhere. Where am I getting that from? Um, Let's see. So I could take from, sorry, I'm just going to have to sort this out now in the background because um, I guess I could take it from my birthday because I still have some time to stuff it up, but I don't really want to do that because um, I have to stuff for mine and my mom's birthday at the same time. And, uh, and I know it sounds selfish, but my birthday is very expensive. Um, my daughter and I go ghost hunting on my birthday. Um, and where we go, it is quite expensive. Okay, so I'm going to take from one, two, uh, three, four. Yeah. Okay, so I just took from the four envelopes that always suffer when we're short. Um, but I have to do it. So... Because I do need an extra 20 for gas. I should have tried to get money from Tyson today. I know he has some. <laughs> His sales have been really good these days. So I know he has a lot of money. Um, I, I just have to take that back out. It belongs here now. So groceries gets nothing. Oh, Mickey. Abby, would you mind putting Mickey outside, please? Thank you. Um, and then personal is getting $35. So... Oh, you know what? Actually, I changed my mind. So, because I don't... Okay, hold on. I'm sorry. So, the few places where am I going to keep this money? Uh, home decor, clothing, and family fun are all still getting. Uh, and I'm just going to give myself 20 um, for personal. This... or Whoops, I did that backwards. Uh, I'm just going to give myself 20 for personal because... Um, yeah, that's what I'm going to do. So I won't put this away just yet because we are going to play with it. However, I do have some, um, stuff to do. So we did have something not exciting, but cool happen this week. So Tyson being, he's a salesman. That's what he do. He does. Calm down, April. I need to calm down. <laughs> Uh, that's what he does um, as a side hustle. Uh, he buys and sells stuff. So he buys it, um, refurbishes it, and then sells it. So um, his sales have been really good for the last couple of weeks. They normally are this time of year. Uh, right after Christmas, he slows right down January, February to about mid-March. 
Um, it's kind of slow, I think, just because of Christmas. And then usually about mid-March, mid they really pick up and that's what they've done. So he normally is like throwing money at me on cash stuffing day and he didn't today. Um, and when he watches this, I hope he feels really bad about it. <laughs> anyway, um, so uh, he, we've been going through Abby's room and taking out all of her, um, the things she doesn't play with anymore, stuff like that. And just trying to downsize because honestly, she's so spoiled. She has more toys than about like 10 kids. It's horrible. Um, she's like the eldest grandchild next to her, or I should say the youngest grandchild next to her is I think like for our parents is in their thirties anyway. So, um, like all of them. So, uh, when she came along, all her aunts, uncles, grandparents, they were all like, oh my gosh, like, um, because she was literally like an only child because all the rest of them were adults. And then besides that, uh, her cousins who are adults treat her more like a niece. So it's kind of like she has like a hundred aunts and uncles. It's, uh, it's, it's pretty crazy. So anyway, um, she gets a lot of stuff. And so we've started downsizing some of the stuff she grew out of and, um, so she had a ton of wooden puzzles, you know, the little wooden puzzles, like they're just adorable, but anyway, a ton of them and Tyson sold them like all in one big massive bundle. Uh, I'm pretty sure it was probably like a daycare or something that bought them because, um, it was a lot of puzzles and I can't see anybody buying that many all at one time for one child. Cause they vary in age range, but anyway, uh, sold them. So she got $40 from that. So that with the five that she had left over, um, from her spending this week, she's able to fill out or fill her $45 envelope. So I'm going to do that now. Now I've already fought with this once and then restarted the video. So <laughs> I should have just left it in here and told you about it, but, uh, yeah, I just, it was too much for me to remember what I'd done and what I hadn't done. And so I just said, Oh, I'm just going to start over. So Oh, it went in there much better that time. Uh, the first time I really struggled to get that in there. Now, there's more. Her $50 envelope. Um, so in our family binder, she has her envelope. This is just, I usually put $5 per week in here, plus her leftover spending. So she has leftover spending. She gets 10 in total. Um, so I said that once this got to $50, I was going to take it out and put it in that envelope. And if you remember... Last week, she had $45 plus two loonies. Um, and I threw three coins in there, a toonie and a loonie, actually, I think, um, to make it the full 50. So during the week this week, I swapped it out, found a $50 bill, exchanged it, and now she has her 50. Sorry, that was a lot of talking for something that didn't need that much explanation. I'm always out of sorts my first, first video, and I think I'm recording four today potentially five um so that would be a crazy week if that's the case I'm not really sure how things are going to pan out uh but we shall see so anywho um yeah so I've already filled these in um I filled out her 45 and her 50 so now her biggest ones all her 50 dollar ones are done they're all filled out so she's just got three $45 ones left and then uh, we move on to the smaller ones. So that's pretty exciting. However, I wanted for us to have $100 spending each per day. Now that may seem excessive, but food, that includes food, everything. So um, transportation, souvenirs, that sort of thing. Um, Tyson probably won't buy a lot in souvenirs. So I anticipate that if he has anything left from his 100, me and Abby will be spending that. Um, however, if you do the exchange rate from Canadian to American, um, I believe right now with the dollar being what it is, if I were to take $100 to the bank and exchange it, I would get $69 American, which means that we need to stuff these with a lot more money. Now, in order for me to be able to keep track of what I need to stuff it with, as I fill this, I will at some point empty it, go to the bank, exchange it, come back, restuff this with American money. So then in the 50, it would be an American 50, not a Canadian 50. Um, and then we will at the end of it have a hundred dollars per day each 
in American. Now I know her, her envelope says a thousand. So if I fill this up, she'll still probably have her, her hundred per day. Um, but I would just rather have it in American. And then I know, and if we have more at the end, when it's done, that money can just get rolled over to the next vacation. That's how I look at it. So that's how I'm going to try to do it is uh, with American money, not Canadian money. Um, my child has just disappeared. Okay, and now $15. What am I going to do with this? Uh, so that normally would go into the 100 envelope. I'm fairly certain. Yes, it would. Um, so do I do that now or do I do that later? Um, oh my goodness, this thing is heavy. I need to, pretty soon I'm going to have to go weightlifting just so I can lift this binder it's so full so i have a 15 and a 10 left in here and that's all so i'll put it in here uh but bella if you're watching go go pour yourself a cup of coffee or you know do something that keeps you busy so you're not seeing me folding i watched her video earlier this week and she said it bothers her so much to see people folding <laughs> bills that she'll sometimes turn their video off please don't turn it off it's just the the savings challenge um i promise you as somebody who works with money every single day people hand me folded bills and i put those away and by the end of my shift um those bills are all straight because of the way that i'm holding them so i promise you they do flatten back out <laughs> Anyway, uh, so, oh, geez, I forgot to mark it. Okay, so um, I'm going to go ahead and mark the 15 in here. Uh, I just thought that was funny when she said that. I mean, I get it. I have my own things as well. You know, the things that just drive you crazy that you have no good explanation for, but they do. So look at all I have left. That's all I have left, which might be why I'm doing a fifth video this week. I haven't quite decided. I have about an hour to decide if that's what I'm going to do or not. But anyway, so that's that done. All right, let's uh, let's play some games. Just, oh, geez, why did I put that away? This is usually my shortest video, and I feel like it's going to be my longest today. <laughs> um, my sweater, you can't see it. All you can see is this. So during my shopping yesterday for birthday and all of that, um, I bought myself a sweater. Why did I buy it? I wish I could show it to you, but I can't because I am a little camera shy. And well, I mean, I'm just a, I'm a hot mess at the moment. So I'm, I'm not going to do that, but I wish I could show it to you. Maybe I can show you the bottom. Can you see the bottom? It's, it's Hogwarts. It's Hogwarts and it's Gryffindor because I took the test and I'm Gryffindor. So anyway, I absolutely love it. My granddaughter's birthday tomorrow is uh, Harry Potter themed. And, um, so I bought this sweater and I'm going to wear it to the birthday party tomorrow, but I put it on tonight for this video because, well, it's chilly in here and it's cozy. So, uh, I have only $20 now. <laughs> That's all I've given myself. So, uh, it shouldn't be, it should still be okay though, because, um, I don't have to roll or anything today because this one here, I'm just going to finish. <laughs> I'm so excited. Um, so it's $5. Tyson gave me $40 earlier this week. Uh, why did he give me $40? I'm trying to remember. Yes, because we took his mom out for dinner for her birthday. And then we were in the car coming home. And I said, oh, by the way, remember to take that money out of your mom's envelope for her birthday dinner. Um, and he was like, oh, I'm not taking that. He says, my mom, I'm paying for her birthday. Uh, so <laughs> anyway, uh, so I, he's like, just do whatever you want with it. So I got home. And I put $6 in here. I finished my March monthly. So that is now done. Yay. Yay me. Um, and I can't remember what else I did with it. But anyway, it's all in here somewhere. Um, I'll probably remember as I go. But anyway, that's exciting. Life's Getting Dicey is done. So that's $5. Um, I have a 20. I didn't give myself change. I've my daughter has disappeared. I feel like I might have hurt her feelings. Um, talking about the noise she was making. Uh, okay, I'm going to swap this out for for this, which I'll probably regret later, but I'm going to, um, just so I have change. Okay, so this goes here. 
this is five dollars and then uh for this one i will roll because i could be really generous and say i'm just gonna throw a 10 in there but i don't want it so i'm gonna roll abby where are you what are you doing in the kitchen playing with what oh she's playing with sand in the kitchen Five. Oh, well, that was easy. Okay, so I'll just swap that out. Uh, so I have uh, five dollars this week, and that's what I have. <laughs> uh, that's okay. Uh, so that is one, two, three, four, and five. Nice. Um, so this one. Two, four, six, eight only has nine to go. Uh, that one only totals $20. This one I'll just be restarting. I'm not going to replace it with anything. Um, I'm just going to restart it because it's, it's, I think it's literally the first savings challenge I ever made. So it's probably my favorite. Uh, it just has like sentimental to me. Someday I would like to go back to trying them all. There's six in total. Um, and I was doing them in my very, very early videos. I was doing them all where I would roll like six dice and fill out all six trackers. Uh, but that was really hard on my budget. So I just couldn't afford to do that. And uh, so now I'm just going to do them uh, like this because that's what works for me. So for now, maybe someday. Uh, anyway, so now Life's Getting Dicey is done. So let me take out... I knew this was going to happen and I prepared for it. So I have a lot of fives here. Um, so this whole 15 goes in here. I'm not going to count this because it's it's a lot. It's a lot of fives. Um, but the 100 is in here and I will take that out after this video off camera. Um, so that's done. That's done. No, you know what? I better take it out. Um... Okay, uh, 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, 55, 60, 65, 70, 75, 80, 85, 90, 95, 100. The rest stays in there. And this goes here. Yay! Uh, it's very fun finishing them and it, it's kind of neat that they worked out that right now I'm pretty much going to be finishing like one a week um, because oh well maybe no actually I won't because these this one still has like four weeks unless I put more than five dollars and this one is at least two weeks so um, but still all right um, and I still haven't decided if I'm going to play just three of them or four of them for now, but I'm just going to leave it for now. Okay. Uh, so that's it, right? Played my games, restuffed my wallet. I think that's it. I'm done. Um, so if you enjoyed this video, please remember to like and subscribe. And, um, this video hopefully won't go up too late tonight. It is very, very late. Abby and I played with Lego all day today. We uh, visited with my daughter all day yesterday, so we weren't home at all. And then today, um, I just, I was in the mood to play with Lego. I Yes, I play with Lego. Um, so I started pulling down my the pieces to my Harry Potter castle and uh, putting them all together in a big castle on my coffee table. And Abby and I have been doing that uh, for most of our day. And then all of a sudden, I was like, oh my gosh, I need to make some videos because I have to make four maybe five this week so um which of course i record all of my videos in one day because i only have one day to do it um so that's a lot of recording and it's late it's like 8 30 which is very late for me um maybe nine might even be nine but anyway if you like this video please remember to like and subscribe uh please hit that thumbs up um and share if you so choose and uh, i will see you guys all on saturday bye everybody Thank you.